you know that wind is simply the flow of gases on a large scale caused by differences in atmospheric pressure? I bet not, but that science doesn't matter to you. Picture yourself strolling through a garden on a warm day when a zephyr, that's a fancy term for a nice gentle breeze, blows up against you and instantly you have this feeling of euphoria as you're enjoying this simple joy of life. Winds can range in velocity from that lovely zephyr to an unpleasant and unsettling gust. Let's go back to the nice breeze. One of the reasons that that gentle breeze feels so good is that in order for sweat to cool your body temperature, the water must evaporate. Beads of sweat on your skin are in liquid form. When the water temperature rises, the molecules become more active and gain energy. When a molecule gains enough energy, it can break free from the bonds that hold the liquid together and it transforms into water vapor. This is evaporation. As the molecule evaporates, its energy, or heat, is removed from the sweat that remains on your body. This loss of energy cools the surface of your skin. Wind has a real Jekyll and Hyde personality, where it can be very helpful, like in the dispersal of seeds, or very destructive, like in the case of hurricanes. Nevertheless, there's just something so great about a nice, gentle breeze. Ah, that feels oh so good.